Assalamu alaikum everyone. We all know that internet is a repository of knowledge. All type of data are available on internet. Linkwise, we share our various data on various social media every day, such as Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and many more. So today, I will show you how to find any one footprint on internet. So let's get started after a short intro. So we need a tool to do this and that is a spider foot. Today we will gather information using this tool. Now to install this tool, first we need to go to a browser. So let's start our web browser. After that, go to Google search bar and type a spider food. So let's type a spider food. S P I D E R F D O O T food. Okay. Now there are many links are available here, but we have to click the first link. Make sure it is a link to GitHub. Beside, I will give this link at description. So let's click this link. From there, you can copy and paste. Now we have to scroll down a bit. So let's scroll down. Okay. Here is the command, and we have to follow this command in our terminal to install this tool. And yes, you need uh, you need to have uh, Python and pip installed in your terminal to use this tool. So let's copy the following command and paste it in our terminal. So let's open our terminal. So we have successfully opened our terminal. Now we will copy the uh, all of this command in our terminal, and we will run this tool. So let's copy the, this following command on our terminal. I have already installed this tool, so it taking less time. But you, uh, when you in this, uh, download this tool, it needs some time, and it take a little bit time, more little bit more time uh, than me. Uh, just copy all this command and paste it in your terminal. So for running this tool, we need to install Python on your uh, on our terminal. So I have already installed Python on my terminal. If you don't have Python installed on your terminal, then you have to install Python first on your terminal. Then you will you can run this. So for running this tool, we have to copy and paste this python dot slash sf dot py hyphen l, and then we have to paste this IP address and the port number. So let's copy and paste this IP address and port number. We want to run this tool on this IP and this port. So as you can see, we have successfully run our tool. On this IP address and this port on our uh, desktop. So let's make it bigger. So we have successfully run our tool on this port. So.
so let's copy this ip address and this port number and let's paste it on our browser sorry we make some mistake uh, unfortunately i press control so this tool has stopped so let's uh, run this tool again uh, now copy the url to uh, the ip and the port let's copy it and paste it on your browser so we have run our tool web version successfully now we will create a scan so for that we have to click new scan okay so here we can search many things like domain name we can gather information about domain name about ip address about host name subdomain bitcoin address subnet subnet we can also gather information about email address phone number human name we can also find username suppose uh, you want to find someone social media account you can use username to find social media account you can also find network asn so today i will show you how you can find someone social media account using username so for that let's create a scan so let's name our scan as hackbit so let's find out how many social media account I have so let's uh, give my username here so for using username we have to add double quotation at the first of our username and the end of our username so let's add double quotation mark at the first of our username and in the last of our username so here are some option so if you want to gather all the information from the uh, internet about this username then select all if you want to if you want to gather the footprint about the username then you can select footprint i want to gather all the information about this username that how many social media account this username have and uh, how many information this social media account has in uh, on the internet so for that we will run this tool so let's run this tool so we have successfully run this tool let me show you on the terminal So as you can see our terminal uh, also run successfully it, uh, it is finding this username uh, account as you can see here many website and searching the username so let's wait and see what we will find from this tool so let's wait and watch So as you can see we have find a public code repository with this username so let's click on this data so as you can see we have get a public repository with this username so let's check this username also you have uh, here is the plus point we have also get the description of the uh, repository so let's 
copy the repository URL and see what we have get. So as you can see, we have get a public repository with this username. So let's wait and also what we get so let's wait and our So as you can see our scan is complete let me show you so here is our scan is completed so let's see what we have get from this tool okay so we get a username and we get a public code repository and we get 14 account on external site so let's check this first okay so we get a github account a gitlab account a hacker rank account uh, and many more we have get 14 account 14 social media account from uh, we have get an uh, tiktok account also that is so interesting <laughs> We have get a YouTube uh, user account, a Hakarat account, uh, and many more account. So, in this way, you can find any on social media account. So, this is today's video. Hope you enjoy this video. If you enjoy this video, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe our YouTube channel. So, thank you so much for watching this video see you in next video with another topics